so we're gonna have a temperature plummet tonight and I'm gonna keep Judy in here I've let her back into here she was in the stable this is her lamb that Susan and I decided to christen lilac so that's lilac and then Ebony's two lambs Yes, Ebony. We've got one lamb. Where's the other one? Where's your other lamb? We decided to call one luster and one li uh, one luster and one. What was the other one? Luster and. Uh, lacquer. So one will be lacquer and one will be luster. Tiny lambs. Ooh. Oh, come here. Come to mama. Oh, there you go. Ah. Very exhausting being born. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. I know, all you're really interested in is food. You kind of care about your lambs, but not hugely. I think I'm gonna give, uh, what should we call that one? One shall be luster and one shall be lacquer. Maybe I'll call this one luster and this one lacquer. Lacquer has a spot under its chin. <laughs> And luster is, I think I'm going to go and get some colostrum for luster because I think, yeah, yeah, yeah. Lacquer's doing okay. But it's, the temperature is plummeting. And so I want to get this one some warm stuff in its belly. This one that I have now called luster she's nearly there she's nearly there no i think i'm gonna because it's gonna give her strength and i want to give her strength because the wind the north wind that's north so the wind is directly coming in here so i am gonna go and get some colostrum and i'm gonna tube a little luster so luster and lacquer and this one over here is lilac and that's oven mitt hello oven mitt yes you good boy how are you you're such a good boy okay i'm gonna go and get stuff to tube feed that lamb ebony go away go on here, here i'll give you a stretch Oh, there we go. Okay. Now, here is little. Hold on, I'm bumping over. Okay, here we go. Oh, no, no. Can you go away? Here, go on, Ebony. Go away. Go away. No, you can't have the milk. I'll try okay. to place myself in the way. Now, <laughs> so oh. we put the tube down the throat. Mm -hmm. And the lamb's suckling action will hopefully make it go down into the stomach. And the lamb is not coughing. So that means the tube has gone down into the stomach. Okay. Now... We do this, and we take this. Oh dear, it's got some hay in it. So that's slightly warm, or oh, it's it's lovely maybe. warm yeah. temperature, not hot. Body temperature, I suppose, of the sheep. Exactly. Yeah, she's. You can see she's drinking. See. 
Well, she's not even drinking. It's, it's going, going straight down. into her stomach. Well, she well, yeah, she doesn't have to swallow. But she doesn't have to swallow. But she just does that reflex because, I guess. It, it, there. <laughs> no, but see, the tube is not going to. Okay. So that's all. And she can't choke because it's. No, it's going straight, straight past. To her stomach, so her, she, to, through to her stomach. Okay. Now, I bring it slowly up because I want it to continue going down. And there we go. Yeah. And, and she's had, had about 120 mil of, um, yeah. now her stomach is lovely and full. Yeah. And she's doing a little waggy tail. Yeah, I see the little So waggy. she'll feel much hey, better sweetheart. now. And that shake, do you see that shake? Yeah. That's a good thing to see in a lamb. Right. Um, she's still hunchy, but that's, that will, um, she'll get, she'll get better that first like you know when you're really hungry and cold mm -hmm. you'll get a bit chilly because your stomach's going to be doing all the digestive work but it'll warm her up now that she has this lovely warmth mm. in her because if you feel her ear do you feel how cold that is yeah so it's the north wind coming in and this just helps accelerate her warming up after lambing and in the coldness and so i might do the other one as well just because it gives it gives them that little bit of help. So um, I'm gonna go get the other one and I'm gonna do this as well. Oh, yikes. Don't fall over now, you're on video. Oh. <laughs> okay, so this is lacquer. I mean, you don't have to go on. <laughs> I'll keep going <laughs> while I've got her. Now, Okay, come on. No, 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 go away. You're not allowed to drink the milk. Oops. Now, because the lamb did that, it's not in her lungs. Okay. Okay, it is. Okay, now wait, I've got to, I've got to do this. Whoa! Wait a minute. Not doing this right. I've got to get you in a more secure position that you won't get out of my grip. Nope, come on. And you can see it's going down the tube. Okay, and a little bit more. Okay. Now let it all go down the tube. Still in the syringe. Some people use the plunger in the syringe. I don't. I like to do it as natural as possible and not force it down. And see, there, she's still doing the drinking action. Mm -hmm. There we go. Okay. See, it's, her ears are not as cold. She's probably had some of her mother's colostrum already. But um, do you feel the ear? Just feel how, yeah, you see, not it's not as cold, cold as the other one. It's not as cold, but not as cold yeah. as the other one. And um, I'm going to put more straw around uh, to add to the um, warmth for the three lambs that are going to be in here. All the other ones out in the fields are fine because they have shelters and sheds and warm mammies. But yeah, these are all, babies. all three of these are very young and fresh. So. Yeah. How's lacquer? Yeah. Yeah. Go back to your mammies that way. Yeah. There you go. Okay. Let's spread fresh straw. And you can see the two lambs are cozy in here. Lovely and cozy and covered in straw. And here's Lilac. Lilac's in a much better position because she was born yesterday. So she's that much older and can, and much bigger, so can gallop around the place. 
but we have loads of straw down and I've spread hay around as well. So it's a mixture of straw and hay and Ebony's munching through some of the hay, uh, some of the straw. Somebody once asked, what's the difference? The straw is the stalk of a grain that's left over. So the grain is harvested and the straw is then dried and turned into bedding. Mm -hmm. And hay are grasses that is harvested and dried for winter feed. So that's the difference. You can see the difference. That's hay, that's straw. There's a marked difference between the two. But there, if you could have the way, Ebony. Look, she's got straw all over her too. Look at that. Cozy, a puddle of lambs in amongst the straw. You couldn't be more cozy than that.